Okay. So assuming that all of you have seen the new, I guess, trailer. Oh, damn. They're trying to see something we know is coming. That's, that's cute. I'm sorry for that one pause. I was praying to party. But yeah, that's cute. Teasing something that's supposed to have already been here. It's kind of... Because I think they think that we like, I'm I'm not excited anymore. Well, I'm, I am excited, but not as excited as I wanted to be because... Because of Aneska and how she came out being. Which is, I guess, like, I don't know. It's a phrase they say, like, if you dump something. I don't know what the phrase. Uh, Paul, I'm doing this live. What the Paul? Uh, fool me once, shame on you, or something like that? So, yeah, I'm, I'm waiting. I'm hella, hella, hella waiting on them, uh, cause they, they can't, they can't, like, try to convince me that Aneska wasn't a flop, bro, she, she was, all that hype, and she, what, she didn't come out as strong as she should have been, like, her neck, her mech is just, like, a big noise maker, bro, it doesn't really do anything, the damage is crazy, and yeah, they credit all these other dope characters, but bro, that's the character that things have been hyping themselves up for, I think, months, of months and years for, and the character was basically useless, bro. Like, on her guns, when, if you can't use her abilities and her guns, like, that often, bro, she's a dud, just, just off the jump. There's no point in even trying to deny that, bro. It's, it's not even, it's a fact, my guy. It's, Nothing's gonna change. She, she's useless. She, she's just basically fan service, and she's bad fan service at that. She's not as twice as cool or as bad as she is in the mission you play her on, or as uh, as just a genuine raider, which is kind of weird. Which is weird, and they, they have potential with the characters, but they missed it because they were in a rush, because they missed the opportunity for Suma. I understand that I could be open, but not like so open that they're trying to tell us that they're not hitting the mark like they should, especially with the whole, uh, the whole Suma gun controversy, well not controversy, but like little tweet they pulled, like they needed help or something. Which I'm not excited because they if they if they make that post before coming up with her weapons that's cool, but bro, seeing as how they 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 pull her back from the uh from the announcement and said Anessa's coming out instead, really took me for a loop because that's who I was hoping for. I didn't really care for Anessa, and I wasn't playing that long game. I wasn't playing baseball that long to even care truly. That's just my opinion. Like, she was like, okay. That's who I was, like, waiting for. That's the character that everybody was like, okay, she's gonna be something. Nowhere in a million years that I was like, they changed it up a week before. Oh, Nesta's coming out. And this is how they they botched it, basically, bro. Like, they, 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 they fumbled it. She's supposed to be, like, this big fan, fan service type thing. I don't like. I see them coming back from it, but I don't see them coming back from it with Suma. They have the first before dropping Suma. They have at least they have like a couple months. They said quarter two, 2019. And uh, yeah, they have to do that. A friend of mine, Tyler, told me it was between April or June. Or maybe I said right. I think it's March, June. But anyway, yeah, that's crazy. So in that time, they need to have like something done for Aneska fast, bro. Just, people paying, people are literally paying 180 for her, and like, 
and it's crazy. And it tried to tease something we already knew was coming. That, that's that, that's funny. But no, seriously, if I'm I'm not I'm not all that thrilled. Truth be told, it's I'm more of a okay, dope. Because like I don't know, I'm I'm burnt out at the game now. I'm burnt out of the game now, truly. And I'm just like, I don't know how to feel about it, because honestly, she, she's coming. Like, okay. But well, then again, she should have been here. Which is crazy. But yeah, I'm not I'm not excited at all, which is kind of crazy. I'm more excited for the update that's going to change everything. And of course, Cruise Me New Gun, that's what I'm most excited for. Hopefully, if they release it, bro. Because I think it's only Janebra, him and Janebra are the only person that hasn't got a gun yet. And their guns are slated to come out hopefully this year. But I really want Cruise Me Gun first, because I don't really play Janebra that often. Well, I do, but only for bosses. Yeah, I had a record first time. Not that often. Okay, that was weird. But yeah, like I said before, um, I'm not as hype as everybody else. That's, that's how I feel about it. And um, I'm more excited for the update that gives us, I guess, monthly or weekly stuff to do. It's kind of crazy. And I don't know why I'm excited for that more than a new character. I do know because they botched Anesca. That was supposed to be their uh, flagship character. Like I said before, I was more excited for Suma than I was Anesca. I didn't really care for Anesca because, I don't know, I just didn't think like, she would be that interested. And then her coming out with them and then like, messing up this, royally messing up this bad, kind of proves it for me. <laughs> Shit, I think I'm coming out with Cole. Yeah, that's just it for me. I don't know. Don't get me wrong. Cool for you guys to come out. Dope. Gun coming. Like, dope. All that good stuff. At the same time, though, <laughs> I don't want them to mess it up. Take as much time as they need. Hell, they don't even wait till, like, January. They can take another month, bro. Like, I understand they, they're a small studio. Which is a sorry excuse, but hey, whatever. They, they're the one making the game. Yo, it's a sorry excuse, but at the same time, if you take more time to get it right, get it right. Don't fumble it. I, I don't, yeah, don't fumble it, bro. Like, it's, it's, the game is great. I'm not saying it's doing great. Will it bring back <laughs> some players? I'm gonna be honest, not, not, I don't really don't see it bringing back any players who's like lost interest, but. Four characters they promised months. A character? No. Let me, let me say this right. Will it bring people back that bring to get people back to the game for a character that they were promised for, promised to get in January of this year? I don't see it. Honestly, I don't because of all the silly stuff that happened. With all the, you know, the Raider, the updates for their and tags and whatnot. For what reason, I don't know why you uh, decided <laughs> to do that. It's a bug. Hopefully, hopefully this is a bug. To keep it like a hundred or keep it a thousand with you. Like this, hopefully this is just a bug. And not some like ploy to get more Raiders playing. Or this is some like stupid attempt. get more rare display because it's not working bro since they're more antagonists like out here beating up new players but it, 
but you want those new players to stay while being royally destroyed by pro level and tags is bummy to me and pro level and tags along with overpowered ads in our enemies and i don't know about i have a theory because i've had way tougher matches with um my friends with our mmr well yeah that's probably the reason i've had more tougher enemies with tougher enemies with my playing with my friends than playing with random people I don't know, but that's kind of crazy that it's like that, even though we can't communicate. Like, something like the game is telling us they don't want us like to play with our friends or something like that. Which, I don't know, it's probably like a, I don't know, put the X-Files theme here, because that's kind of how I'm feeling right now, because it's kind of weird, bro. It shouldn't be this hard if you was like people in your clan, or people that are, uh, People, it shouldn't be hard with people that are in your clan or whatever. It should be, the mission should run smooth. It shouldn't have any hiccups from overpowered enemies of any sort. But, I, I guess. I don't know. It's just a theory that I'm pretty sure is true. But yeah, like I said, this ended up to be in a whole other discussion about other stuff but yeah Suma I'm excited for I'm not excited as for this new update that they had out hopefully this update comes out this week or next week because I'm I want to get I'm not saying I want um Thursday they're announcing Gearbox is going to pack these and they're announcing hopefully they announce Borderlands Borderlands 3 and the Borderlands 1 the remaster hopefully Let's they are because if they don't, <laughs> so that's what's being held. The, the press conference or whatever is being held in Boston. But yeah, I'm pretty sure people on the internet would riot if they didn't announce something. Something bad will happen. Just put it like that. It will be crazy. But yeah, uh, that's what I'm on right now and all this other stuff. And I guess uh, I leave y'all to the not well weird I never had a video where uh why I was done with the topic already that's weird for me but yeah I'm just really always with the gameplay for now and I'll uh, see y'all next time I will be uploading more more videos soon I don't want my hard drive to get all backed up with videos so I'm be I will be posting more frequently like not day by day Hopefully, day by day, I'm not really doing anything else at the I'm going to try to upload more and get to see those things play. What you want?